What are you doing here? Do not tell me you have come to defeat Velkuvrana. You are not even ten years old, child. Yet here you stand to confront one who has lived for a millennium. No matter. You have the Tractatus de Monstrum, yes? <laughs> now then, before I finish merging, I would like it to record what I'm about to say. <laughs> Consider this a final act of kindness before I fully abandon my humanity. Now, Tractatus de Monstrum, listen carefully. The purpose of the labyrinth of refrain is to act as an egg which encases a being known as Velkuvrana. With each world acting as a layer in that egg, it could grow without interference from people or witches. However, it died before it could hatch. Velkuvrana is not a flesh and blood creature. It can be revived, but to do so requires a physical body to act as a medium. Thankfully, there was a witch at the Magic Academy who had the spiritual potential to become that medium. She was too weak. But you, Luca, inherited your mother's power. So I was prepared to use you as the medium and revive Velkuvrana so that it could hatch. But I am pleased Isara's body could be salvaged after all. Yes, I mean you and Dronia to carry out my bidding. But... Trakti has free will! Trakti isn't... <laughs> How precious. Free will, you say? The Tractatus de Monstrum, written by the one man to escape the labyrinth of refrain. You did not know that was a made-up story? It was me! I authored that book! I never intended for a soul to reside in it, though. How clever. Do not worry. I shall explain everything. I hail from another world. One of many that have been destroyed by Valkuvrana's wrath. I have traveled across many worlds, each time possessing a new form. During my travels, I discovered the truth. Velkuvrana. As an immortal being, Velkuvrana cannot truly be defeated, but its immortality can be harnessed. But then, why didn't you use the three keys as soon as you had them? If you had done that, then... Unfortunately, you stupid child, this is the first time all three keys have been assembled. I could not risk losing a single key, not with immortality at stake. With each key I found, 
I made sure to hide it well. Two of the keys I entrusted to residents of other worlds. And then, when I found the last key in Campanula, I encountered a bothersome great sage who tried to interfere. In a moment of weakness, I was injured. So, I hid the key near the entrance and fled to Tannis. But I was in no hurry, for I was certain that none but I could assemble all three keys. I created antechambers to link the different worlds, and the Tractatus de Monstrum was the key I created to travel between them. Do you realize what that means? The Tractatus de Monstrum itself is the key to locating the three keys I desire. you connect worlds that didn't have a key? Was that on purpose? Did you mess up? <laughs> what does it matter? It is not my responsibility to safeguard other worlds. Such concerns are beneath me. That's awful. You're terrible. You are not even ten years old. Do not presume to lecture me, child. But, Madam Baba... You're someone else. You're just possessing Madam Baba, aren't you? Yes, but that was my biggest mistake. My plan fell to ruin after I was injured by the Great Sage and fled Campanula to hide in Thanis. Taking possession of this Baba Yagavich was the start of a long period of stagnation. Furthermore, the mana in this world, Thanis, is too thin. As a result, I could not use this body to return. From there, you know the rest. Now that I have said all that needs to be said, I will consume you, the Tractatus de Monstrum, and... Hmm? Where did that owl wander off to? I have not forgotten the denizens of Yggdrasil. Those intrusive owls who fly between the boundaries of time and space. Their power posed a threat to my plan, so I destroyed their world. Now they are but a footnote in my rise to power. But enough talk. Once Velcovrana reaches maturity, I will merge with its eternal body and soul and devour all of existence. You understand, yes? You, Dronya and Isara were just pawns in my long struggle. Yes. Just disposable little pieces. <laughs> Please wait, Madam Baba. I'm sure you didn't feel this way when you started your journey. I have forgotten the past, and I will never remember it again. Now, I will seize my destiny, and I will not allow you or the Tractatus de Monstrum to stop me!